The drive-in theater was once a popular icon for the good life in the American West. Well, they're getting pretty hard to find. Part of the experience was certainly the movie, but really the most fun was being in the car watching it with your family and friends. So if you're missing going to the drive-in, there's a fall show at the Charles M. Russell National Wildlife Refuge that's a must see. And this was uh, the area where all the offices and the shop and all the administrative buildings were originally for the Charles M. Russell National Wildlife Refuge. And so what happened was the elk got used to being in here and this is where they come during rut. Since the public was already enjoying it and already knew about it, we wanted to keep that part of the elk viewing experience available to them, so we kept it closed. And so that's why you see these signs up, to allow the elk to do their thing and allow everyone to enjoy what they can see here. I think people are uh, amazed when they see the number of elk, how close they are, and the size of some of the bullets. Like the other night, I think we classified uh, 500 elk in this closed area, and there were 44 bulls that were five points or better. Uh, that is phenomenal to see that in a, in a small area like this. And the scenery here is uh, phenomenal. When you look at the pictures, the traffic seems a little chaotic. But things settle down pretty fast when the elk come out. Because everyone's here for the same reason. To see one of Montana's greatest shows of the fall season. This is Mike Grunet, out among Montana's Fish, Wildlife and Parks.